All right, we're dealing with the pre-chorus, the first pre-chorus, and the chorus to start right here. It's got some, some moving bass lines on it. And um, so if we go pre-chorus to three, four, we won't see the part set free and the tie runs for me. Come down and I'll land here, here. The church, if we won't see a change in the world out there. Chorus. It's got to start right here. Start right now. Lord, I'm starting right now. There was that, that those two licks in F sharp. We remember there's some pushes, open pushes in the open E. But those licks in the F sharp up there at the ninth fret, that first one's what? Uh, remember that to, to get to, uh, if we just go to the chorus and then stop. If it's got to start right here, say eighth notes, got to start right now. Then there comes our F sharp. Yeah, so it's actually sliding up, up to that A flat, if you will, and then back down to the E. Yeah, and then the second one's gonna do the same thing, but a little, a little pop, 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 pop right? Mm -hmm. So how does that go? Yep, getting us back to the C sharp, but that gets us all the way to the vamp. <laughs> 